Let me see. I have my paper, I have my pen, and I have my mind. I got my side hustle. I got my side hustles. My money makes money, makes money, make money. I got my side hustle. I got my side hustle. I put a little in investment, put a little in savings, put my little in my business. Now I'm banking, banking, banking. That rhymes. I got my side hustle. I got my side hustle. If you ain't making money, then you a damn fool. You should have went to Ross World 123 school, teaching you money. And teach you to dividends, compounding on money, you know how this shit ended in. I'm kind of freestyling, ain't nothing on this paper. I'm always talking about you getting more paper. Don't know how to rap. I hope you did like it, because now it's over. Hey, Ross World, my money makes money. And no, I cannot rap. But today, I'm talking about side hustles. Now, you heard me say it at least twice before about... I wanted to sell shades. Now, give me a second here. I have all these different shades about different things. Now, we know these are the aviators. Now, not to be confused with those $200 pair or $300 or $500 pair. These is about $2 or $3. Now, some of you will say, hey, those are not bad. Now, I've had these almost a year, almost a year, and I take care of them. Two or three dollar pair of shades that I would sell to you for about 15, 20 bucks. Okay, so these are kind of like the limelight. You're doing big things, you know what I'm saying? Side hustle. Then you got these. Your everyday, your point dexter, like, hey guys, we're going over there, we're going to climb the mountain. They really stiff, you know what I'm saying? Side hustle type stuff. You feel me? Stay with me now. Now, these are kind of the limelight. I'm showing off, you know what I'm saying? Everything is lit. Oh yeah, I can't see nobody in the club. Nobody can't see me. I might run into somebody and you spill your drink. Nevertheless, side hustle. Look at all these shades I got. This is the point I'm making, right? These are some kind of like, I'm riding my bike. I don't want a bug to get in. These kind of like uh, the blockers. Remember the old school senior citizen blockers? Even though I get a little air in there. Side hustle, right? Another pair of shades. God damn. These are kind of like my shooting glasses. They're yellow tinted when I go to the range. And I shoot my weapons, just practicing, you know, saying on my marksmanship skill, pow, pow, pow. not to kill nobody, but just in case. Side hustle. That is my side hustle. Not yet, okay? I wanted to be my side hustle, but now that you guys know my secret, that I'm going to buy these cheap ass shades from China <laughs> and then sell them for people for three times quarter the price. Side hustle. That is what a side hustle is. It doesn't really take over your main source of income. But it helps you to maintain residual and passive income the way that you use it. Understand I had said at one point that you have one income, most of us, if you're not investing, if you're not saving, you have one income. That money is going out to what? How many expenses? You know, car note, car insurance, if you're renting an apartment, if you're buying a house, if you have a mortgage, uh, if you have cable, the internet. You have all these expenses, bills. You have bills that you pay monthly or quarterly or, or, or semi-annually or annually. It doesn't matter. You only have one income. So what are you doing to offset to, to receive some of that income? Now, great, you're investing. Great, you're saving. You're diversifying your investments, which I will really get into detail about later. Not on this video. <laughs> but a side hustle. What is something that you love to do? Maybe you love to bake. Maybe you love to cook and maybe you can sell muffins to the neighborhood. You put up some little flyers. If it's in a close knit community, you really don't have to pay or register with the state. It just depends on the neighborhood, but watch your city laws. Make sure you read up on your city laws. Research, okay? So that's all types of side hustles you can do. You'll just be amazed if you just listen to people or what they really want. Oh, I wish somebody would sell this. I wish somebody had this so I can do that. There's many a ways to make money. I'm not here to give you the ideas, okay? Because then I would want 5%. Yeah, like that. So I'm not going to give any more ideas because somebody already took my damn shades idea. I know somebody like, let me go on DHgate. Damn it, I told you the website. Oh, wish. Man, my mouth just runs. But anyway, you go to these websites and they have all these items that you can buy. Whether it's clothes, uh, shades, gadget, knives. And you can just sell it online, through Amazon, through eBay, through Overstock, 
there's many websites you can sell your items through a little side hustle. And like I said before, maybe you like to bake cakes and muffins and cookies, or you might like to barbecue ribs, and you just want to sell it to your neighborhood. Nevertheless, you have a side hustle, or you want to cater to the neighborhood. You have a side hustle. Just like my son, he goes around the neighborhood, he's looking for a job, but he's cutting grass. Side hustle, well, his main hustle for right now, right? But side hustle, that side job that's going to bring in residual and passive income that you're not really accounting for. And this is the great thing about a side hustle. This is the great thing about a side hustle. You're an entrepreneur because a side hustle to me is something that you created. You're not just going a part-time job. Notice I did not say part-time job. You are now breaking into entrepreneurship on something really, really small. Maybe it's selling lights. Maybe you want to sell flashlight. Remember I told you, the major commodity around the world, the major thing around the world is selling. That is how you make money. And somebody say, oh, well, you can trade. That You're still selling something. There's an exchange of something. Sales. So I'm putting it out there. If you have an idea and it's not going to deplete your savings or investing, and you just want to test it. You want to test in your neighborhood. You want to test it at your local school. You want to just test it, okay? Watch out for your local laws of, you know, being a salesperson. But try to side hustle and see how much money you can make, if any, okay? That way, you're not out there just depending on one income. And who knows? That side hustle may be your main hustle. And next thing you know, you're building a business off of it. This is Ross World where uh, when you hustle, that's not a bad thing especially if it's on the side. I'm out.